Hi guys, we're in my kitchen. Uh, the central heating boiler's on, so there's a bit of a hum in the background, but we should be okay. Got a request here from somebody who wants a car that will use gravity to travel three metres. Now, when they said gravity, what they added in the comments was it was just to go down a slope. It's not one of those with a weight pulling a string, it's just using the potential energy from a slope to actually drive the car forwards. Now I did ask for more details like what was the length of the slope, what was the height of the slope, that sort of thing, and I haven't had a reply. So all I'm going to do is use one of my ordinary rubber band powered cars. It's just a cardboard sheet, a couple of drinking straws either end, with um, barbecue skewers for the axles and CDs with bottle tops on them for the wheels but no rubber band and all I'm going to do is let it go down the slope and see if it goes three meters now I've already measured, in fact my floor is already, already marked out the end of this piece of wood is on the beginning red line and those two little drink cartons at the other end are on the three meter mark. So if it goes past those drink cartons, it's done three meters from the end of the ramp. So at the moment, this ramp is, what's that? About 15 centimeters high. In fact, it's slightly less than that. What I'll do is I'll drop it down so it's just 10 centimetres or 100 millimetres and we'll let it go. Still a touch too high. Right, so I've measured it. Oh, it's just off the screen here, but the end of this ramp is now 100 millimetres, 10 centimetres from the floor, and the ramp is a metre long. So if I put the car on the ramp, it's starting 100 millimetres above the ground, and we'll see how far it goes. Well, you can see that went the full length of the kitchen with no trouble at all. And that's only 100 centimetres off the ground. 100 millimetres off the ground. I was going to add some weights <laughs> to see if that made any difference. But it's already doing the distance, so there's not much point in doing that. I've just added two 5 ounce lead weights to the car. And we'll see if we can work out whether it accelerates any faster, which is what I think would happen. So we'll have to look at the timing on the camera to see if we can work out if it's going faster. I think it was. Well, I've got to say, that's easier than I expected. I've no idea what the rest of the criteria was, because I didn't get an answer to my questions. But there we go, one of my typical, simple, rubber band powered cars. I've given it a one meter ramp that's lifted by 10 centimeters. And it did the three meters easily. Didn't even worry it. That would have carried on for a lot further if there was more space to go. Job done.